Hi, I'm Sue, partner of Scott's Permaculture. Uh, just letting you know the secret's out. I haven't used shampoo or conditioner for three years now. I make up my own little concoction that I learnt about. Um, it's using bicarbonate of soda for the shampoo, well, for the wash, and a combination of vinegar, uh, apple cider vinegar, honey, and essential oil for the condition. Um, with the wash, I use this is a I bought this in bulk, so I haven't got the container to show you. The the um, amount is one third of uh, carb soda or bicarbonate of soda or uh, baking soda. So you just put one third of that. I just use these little cheap bottles from one of the supermarkets. Sorry, I'm being a bit messy here. Okay, so we've not got about a third in the container. Let's go to the tap. So just fill it up with water. Okay, the lid back on. Let's give it a good shake and it's good to go. So it's just like a, a, a bit of a slurry. Okay, I use it on my face and around my neck and everywhere as well. And after I rinse that off, this is the, uh, the conditioner. Honey, special brew from a friend. Yes, I usually put about a, a dessert spoonful of that. Some sh a few shakes of lavender essential oils. Just gives it a nice smell. And apple cider vinegar, you can use the organic one if you want. Either way, I just use this one. I use this one for drinking for my cholesterol. <laughs> so this one's four parts to one with water. I don't do exact measurements, but you can if you want to. And then top that up with water as well. I use this every day. I, I, um, I get a dry, itchy scalp and some psoriasis. So this helps with that as well. I, I think it helps to keep my hair, my scalp stimulated. So I haven't had a problem with it since I've been doing this. There we are. So just put the lid back on. Give it a good shake. Honey settles on the bottom, but it does dissolve. There's lots of nasty poisons in shampoos and conditioners. That's what made me do some research into using alternatives rather than putting all those poisons into my scalp. We, uh, we try and limit the poisons that go into our body by eating healthy and doing not putting poisons into our property so I think it sort of has to be a holistic approach. Okay that's it. Have a try. Thank you.